Hey, I'm Rob, and welcome to the homestead. I made a shovel into a guitar. <laughs> hey, you're probably wondering why. <laughs> There's a great story to it, and hopefully it'll be informative for you, and if anything else, <laughs> at least it's going to be really entertaining. So, so hang on. We'll try to do this quick here. So it's a crazy world that we're all living in. But the thing is, is it's always been crazy. It's just that today we're more aware of it because everybody has a camera and the media is like 24-7, 365. But, you know, all through history, things have been happening. We've had wars and famines and, and you know, pandemics and all kinds of things. And, and, you know, here in the United States, we had the Civil War. The whole, we've had the World War I, we've had the Spanish Flu, we've had a Depression, we've had World War II, we've had a Cold War, we've had the Vietnam War. You know, think, it's just there's always something to be concerned about. And you have to live your life. I live my life and you need to live your life. And, you know, it's kind of a, every morning when you get up out of bed, the fact that you look down at the grass instead of looking up at it, you know, that's a good day. And I want you to, you know, think about things like that. So what's that have to do with me making this guitar? Well, the thing is, is, you know, we're always looking for things to do and it's just so easy to get caught up in that, that hamster wheel of, of life. And I want you to always be curious to always be exercising your imagination. And I feel that's really important. So even though you have your routine to go through and your things to do, it's really important to do things that are fun, to exercise that imagination. And that's why I decided to make this guitar. While we're all sitting at home doing you know, our non-routine things because of being quarantined or jobs or, or whatever, is one of the things that I've done is I like to do is of course watch YouTube videos and there's this guy called C6 Steve and he makes guitars out of, of hubcaps and all kinds of crazy things broom handles hamburger spatulas you know he uses all kinds of goofy stuff to make cigars cigars to make cigar box guitars and then there's another guy up in the Nashville area, Justin Johnson, and he made a shovel guitar. So that's kind of where between C6 Steve and Justin Johnson, I got the idea to make this, this guitar. And again, it's all about living life. It's all about you living the life of your dreams, living happy, living fun loving, and living carefree. So that's why, you know, you just want to think up and things to do for fun. And again, and life's about the journey, not just the destination. So I spent, I spent about 12 days building this guitar, you know, working a little bit and thinking about it and planning and looking stuff up. I could have just built it in one day, probably. But what would have been the fun of that? Just getting it done. So, you know, working on it and planning. And, and thinking up steps and ordering all the different parts. You know, that was all part of, of the path, the journey, and having fun. And then I haven't been able to play it because I want to play it outside with my, I got a new Marshall amp that I got, and I've been using a little 10 water that I bought locally from a, a guy that's in the same town that I'm in. And I built this guitar, and the, the thing that's, so I haven't, tested it out yet I've, I've been playing it just like this you know and I've got a little tuner on here so I could kind of get a feel where the notes are because this you play a shovel guitar by your by your ear because there there are no there are no frets on here and you know the strings are, are way above the you know I, I can just I can run my fingers under here so um, you can't fret it, so you use a you use a slide, and this is a ceramic slide. And then I, you know, got my pick here, and so we're gonna play it in a second for the very first time ever. So again, that's why I said this should be. Hopefully, it'll work and it should be entertaining. And I was actually a little concerned that I might get uh, electrocuted doing this, but my a friend of mine on Facebook, Chris, 
informed me that there's there's no electricity here in the guitar that it's just this this p90 coil that i put on here you know picks up the vibration of the strings because of them it has a big magnet in there and the coils and then it, it sends it through the wire over there to the amplifier so right now everything's turned off so you don't don't hear anything but and we're going to fire it up in a minute but again you know because the thing of, of worrying about tomorrow doesn't stop the concerns from from not happening and one of my my favorite analogies is you know in the sailboat world is um, you can't change the direction of the wind so you adjust your sails to get to your destination so in in our real life world you know I'm not talking about you being a, a Pollyanna kind of person where you just go oh isn't life wonderful oh boy happy everything is just keen and great and dandy you know that's not what I'm talking about but you know pay attention to the world which is like the wind know where it's coming from know what's happening is it hard is it soft is it you know unsteady what what's going on with the world but then you adjust your sales in your life so that that you can live your life and get to where you want to go and be happy because we we can't change that that big world out there so and that's why i i started seven months ago i bought a cigar box guitar off of ebay because that i said you know i'm going to do something fun and keep the old old brain exercised and keep my curiosity going and in exercise in my imagination so seven months ago I started playing a cigar box guitar off of eBay with my my 10 watt little amp and then I just built this guitar in the past 12 days and I finished it three days ago but that crazy tropical storm crystal ball or whatever why can't they just pick a nice easy name like Ann or George or Sally or something but I Chris whatever it is but it went right past us just to the west so it, it's been crazy windy here and we've had quite a bit of rain so I couldn't get outside and it's a little bit breezy today and I'm, I'm kind of standing in the shade of a tree here so hopefully you can see me um, but so I've been really anxious so I've been playing it in the house just quiet like this while looking at my little tuner here to get a, a feel for the notes are and and I've I know three songs I've learned three songs in the seven months that I've been playing the cigar box guitar so um, I'm gonna play one of those here for you in a second and hopefully I won't make too many mistakes and that's why I said it's gonna be entertaining but again the point is for you to do something that is fun in your life no matter what is going on in the world direct yourself so you can have a good time so alright let me turn this thing on and we'll play one of my three songs that I know how to play and uh, let's let's hopefully this thing is even gonna work so <laughs> it's uh, I don't know if you can see all the the wires in that on the back of it here and uh, bridge and an aluminum bar for the for the nut up here and I've got the tuners you know in the handle and it's it's three strings so let's give it a go <laughs>
So live happy, fun loving, and carefree. Subscribe, share with your friends, and watch another video. <laughs> They'll be entertained.